That was the scenario at Latif Hotel and Suite, situated at Ugwa Magba Axis in Benin City as the building was pulled down on the order of the state government. Residents and shop owners watched helplessly as the hotel was demolished, said to be erected on government land. linking the area we are cordoned off by security personnel drawn from the Nigerian police and the Nigerian Security and Civil Defense Corps. The special advisor to Governor Gordon Obaseki on media, Pastor Kruso Osage, who said the demolition exercise is going to be a continuous one in order to reclaim all illegal structures built on government property, stressed that all the court injunctions placed on Latif Hotel and Suite have been vacated despite the court restriction by the petitioner. It's just one of the many removal of uh, illegal properties that are either sitting on right of way of, you know, the water flood parts or violating one building code or the other in the state. This, this process has been ongoing since, since uh, about a year and a half ago you know, and it's going to be a, an ongoing process even after now. So uh, the said uh, 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 building which we just spoke about it's not it's not just one you know you know standing on its own it's just one out of many other um, uh, corrections that have been carried out by the Ministry of Fiscal Planning of the Edo State Government. The court case on Latif Hotel and Suite spanned several months. Patience Osaugiwa reporting.